lives up in Eugene, Oregon, and works there for her sport in the National Academy of Artistic Gymnastics, where she leads a grinding gymnastics life beginning every day at 6 a.m. Sometimes, you know, you get there in the morning and you just sort of get on the bar and think, I don't want to do this. <laughs> but after you get going, it doesn't, you know, it's not too bad. I'm pretty much used to it because we've been doing it since, you know, the summer, and so I'm used to it and everything. Few young athletes in any sport put in a harder day than Tracy. After a grueling workout in the gym each morning, she joins other children her classroom each afternoon. <laughs> the Eugene, Oregon Board of Education allows Tracy Talavera and the others at the Gymnastics Academy to attend school in the afternoon. There they get their basic academic subjects crammed into just a couple of hours of classroom work. I think that the costs are heavy in terms of social life. Uh, these young people work out seven hours a day plus carry their regular school load and do their homework and so forth. There's little time for anything else. I think that's a cost. Well, I have a, you know, a few friends in classes that I see, you know, because we have the same classes every day and I see them. But, like, I don't really know them or anything. So I have friends to talk to at school, but I don't know that good. After school, Tracy works with weights, continuing on a routine that she has followed since she moved in with the Mobile Hills three years ago with the blessing of her parents in San Francisco. I figure it costs about $5,000 a year. That's not counting trips. Whenever she goes on a trip, we pay her fare plus a portion of the coach's fare. And if a piano player goes, we pay a portion of his fare. If six girls go, we pay one-sixth of their whole expense of the trip. Which makes gymnastics a very elitist sport in this country. <laughs> Tracy Talavera wasn't born a star. It took sacrifices by her parents, the Mulva Hills, and of course by Tracy herself. One of those magical days when it all comes together, everything seems worth it. What a day.